A performance report with curbside construction and the Gameco GT3200 sidewalk paver. This machine is a high volume sidewalk paver. The GT3200 features a high volume folding conveyor to feed the hopper. The slip form mold is minimum clearance. and a trimmer for accurate grade and for maximum concrete utilization. We visited with Jerry DiPietro, who operates the paver and whose family owns curbside construction. Now you've operated uh, which Gameco machines? Uh, 3600, 6300, and uh, this new one over here, the uh, 3200 sidewalk uh, paver. Which one's your favorite? So This one here. Really? Yeah, 100%. Yeah, I, I'm still not over how much you do in a day. Like, I'll constantly surprise me. Not over, it's only been a year and a half. So, uh, and uh, I'm, I'm still amazed at how much we were able to do. But you were kind of instrumental in buying it, weren't you? I was actually. Well, I, I, know, I knew what it could do. And, uh, but my, it was my brother's domain as to whether he can sell a machine slip forming sidewalk or not. Right, so I'm like, I knew it was gonna, uh, it was gonna be high production for it, but uh, whether the cities and towns would accept it or not, because it's uh, something new, that was up to him. Mm -hmm. So, but uh, so far it's been, it's been good. Like uh, uh, everywhere we've gone, people have liked it. So, it's so far so good. But it's all new construction. Uh, new construction and as new subdivision type of work. And no, we do like uh, we've done. We've we've crammed it in uh, some places in Whitby. Uh, uh, it was reconstruction, and uh, it was a one meter boulevard, one point five meter boulevard. So we had at every single driveway. I was pouring two percent slope, two percent, and then we had drops going into the driveway. And during the transition, I went from two to four to match the driveways. So I'm able to do, I mean, it's not, uh, if you're going from 2 to 10% or something really crazy, but I've gotten into some pretty, uh, uh, you know, tight, tight spots for it. Did you? Yeah, and I still managed to, to uh, um, Was it to one move. of those situations where you had to run the belt around the trees and all that? 100%, yeah, yeah. trees on one side, bush on the other side. The only time it doesn't have clearance is if, uh, you know, I have a tree and, and the branch happens to be like height wise, right? Mm -hmm. The height. You know, yeah. but uh, other than that, like you, you can cram it in some pretty tight areas. It's triple. Oh, at least. Like I, I'm just being really safe saying, okay, it saved us a month and a half. That's like super, super conservative. conservative yeah. Yeah, like that day we did 25 loads. That's like a week's worth of work. We did it in a day, a week, in one day, you know? That's yeah. incredible. That is incredible. This has been a performance report with curbside construction and the GT3200 high volume sidewalk paver. Gomego, the worldwide leader in concrete paving technology.